it's time for another adventure. I'm going to take the KX2 out again. I've got about an hour and a half of free time and daylight left. I'm going to go to the same park that I've been going to. This time I am combating the mosquitoes. I have a long sleeve shirt on. I just got off of Amazon. It's a Columbia, I don't know, it's an outdoor shirt. It's kind of thin. It kind of feels thin. I got the extra large. It feels a little bit too big, but I'd rather have it too big than too small. Anyway, I've got the shirt, long sleeve shirt, and I've got the hat, and I treated it with this stuff called... I treated it with this stuff called Pike Garadin or something. Uh, it's supposed to get this... It got really good reviews. It's supposed to help uh, mosquitoes. I treated the shirt, I treated the hat, and I'm wearing pants too. I don't have really good outdoor pants, but this shirt feels really cool. Like it breathes really well. I think there's a lot of vents in it. Um, it didn't cost that much really, but uh, it's important to have a long sleeve shirt and yet be cool at the same time. So I got, got me an outdoor shirt and I treated it with picaridin or whatever it is and I treated the hat, I sprayed the hat. It claims that you can, uh, if you treat your shirt, it will last up to six weeks. One of the things that has been a problem of mine is, uh, and I haven't focused on it yet, but it's the slow deployment of my mobile or portable gear. It's taken me too long to get my stuff out and ready. I'm going to work on that right now. I'm going to try to deploy it quickly. Um, something that takes a little bit of time is, is the way I throw into a tree. That takes some planning. So um, I usually spend a lot more time getting it just right, and I'm going to try to speed that up a little bit. I really want to use that 60 foot long chameleon antenna, um, but as I've said in other videos, using that antenna is challenging because 60 feet is really hard to get up into the air. It's not so hard to get 60 feet, but it's hard not to get it tangled or spread it out in a nice way. Uh, time is an issue when you're portable like this. You don't want to spend time setting up, setting up, setting up. And you want you want to get out there and start making contacts and get on the air, you know. And you know, if I was willing to sit on the ground, I would have a lot more antenna options. The problem with that is sit, I can't sit on the ground very well um, because it hurts my back. No matter if I try to sleep or sit on the ground, my back ends up hurting really bad. Shirt is freaking awesome. I've got the window open and I can feel the air blowing through it through the back. It's almost like there's holes in it. It feels like there's holes in this shirt. And it's not, it's not cotton. I mean, it has cotton in it, but it's not cotton. It doesn't have that heavy feel to it. I love this shirt already. It just feels like there's a cool breeze blowing through the shirt. I can see wearing this on a really hot day and even in the sun, actually being cooler than not wearing a shirt at all. I'm gonna try something a little bit different. I have this fold up table and some really tall trees. I'm going to set up without a park bench. Um, these pants do not match. I need to find some outdoor pants. Uh, I am not afraid of mosquitoes tonight. Because <laughs> I've got protection. So I have this fold up table that I've been keeping in my car. I haven't used it yet. I'm, I use, I have a lot of camping gear. This is actually more for camping than anything else. But it's a fold up table. It's pretty cool. It has drink holders underneath. Pockets right here. Got my bench, chair, tree. If we can get set up. Let's take a look. Blew it trying to be fast. Um, had a lot of trouble with this bag. If you don't open it just right throws all the string everywhere and gets tangled. I just had a really nasty tangle. I'm um, having all kinds of problems tonight and now the sun is quickly going down so I'll be lucky to make a single contact. Tons of problems. The mosquitoes are really out now. I think oh, they're really bad. 
Uh, I'm gonna hit my spray real quick. I had every problem in the book. I had, it took me 10 minutes to unfold that. I must have done it wrong. It just would not unfold. These things are harder to fold than they look like. I've got a, a radio set up. I've got the random wire, which is actually 21 feet. I now have, look at this, strain relief. Strain relief right here pulls tight my antenna around the tree over there and doesn't pull on the radio. This is a problem. Look how loose that is. I don't like that. It doesn't seem like a good connection to me. I screwed around so much that my sun is going down. I will say there are mosquitoes everywhere, but they're just kind of bouncing and leaving. One even landed on my hand. He landed on my hand and took off. None of them are landing on my pants. They're everywhere, but they're not bothering me. Occasionally one will get in my face, but this seems to be working. I have yet to figure out how it folds. It took me 10 minutes to unfold it. It looks simple, but if it doesn't come out right, it gets stuck. So I thought I would uh, practice my throws. I'm gonna try to get it. I'm gonna try to get it higher. That's really high though. This shirt has actually worked really well. Um, there's a couple times where I was leaning over and it felt tight in the back, and that's when uh, Seems like mosquitoes get you when it's real tight against you, you know. They can go through the shirt, but... Anyway, I haven't had any bites, knock on wood, but they have been in my face. The throw did not go where I wanted it to. I'm practicing my throws now, by the way. It seems like that last part gets caught up in itself. Um, that throw went really high. It's actually aiming over there, but it went really high. And I got this tangle. Oh, it came off. This um, fine cordage, it actually untangles really well. It tangles easily, but it also untangles easily. I'll set up again. This time, this knot that I had to make when I tied extra cordage to it, I still need to cut these ends off. I haven't done it, but. I think that might be catching it. All right, I'm going for the grand prize. All the way over. I wish I could hold this camera for you. That time I actually smacked that branch and it fell straight down. Still a good throw. Again, going for the top branch. I sure wish I knew how far that was.
learn something. Whenever there's a self knot, you know, like a knot like that, there's always a loop in it. And if you can push that loop through, it'll it'll fix itself. There's always one of these loops in it. See? This thing that uh, one of the keys to greater height, maybe five or ten more feet, is the jump afterwards. I'm trying to go for not this lower branch, but that higher one. It seems to be right in the middle is about my max right now. But I almost got it last time. I'm going to try it with a jump. It might look a little weird, but it helps. Okay, this table breaks down. Pretty nice little table. I mean, I wouldn't want to take it on a hike. But it breaks down pretty easy. Mm -hmm.